Hi, my name is Malcolm Finley. I'm a consultant cardiologist at Bart's Heart Centre, and I do my private practice at One Welbeck in central London. We use catheter ablation to treat many different heart rhythm disorders, particularly atrial fibrillation. And now we mainly do these as a day case procedure. So patients come in uh, in the morning and they'll go home the same day. The standard sort of procedure is patients come in around seven o'clock in the morning. Uh, they come to the day case area at One Welbeck and uh, we do the basic tests, an ECG and usually a blood test and put, the, uh, put a needle in the top of the arm. I'll see the patient, uh, I'll see you before the procedure and then we also get uh, the anaesthetist to come around and he'll explain what they're going to do. When it's time for the procedure, uh, we walk through to the operating theater and introduce, uh, everyone introduces themselves to you and we'll have you lie down on the, uh, on the theater, theater table and go through our safety checks. Uh, once that's done, the anaesthetist will get you off to sleep, usually with an injection in the, in the arm. And uh, once you're asleep, the procedure can, can start. We'll use ultrasound to get the tubes in the top of the leg. Um, and uh, we'll also put a very small uh, telescope test down the gullet, down the esophagus, uh, to have great views of the heart. That gives us an ultrasound view of the heart, which improves uh, safety by making sure we don't have any clots in the heart. And will also show us if there, uh, it will help guide us during the procedure. We'll pass the tubes up to the heart and uh, the specialized wires that allow us to track down where abnormal heart rhythms are coming from. And when we find those areas, we can then apply energy to the different, uh, the different abnormal areas to treat the underlying heart rhythm problem. At the end of the procedure, uh, the tubes will all come out and we'll put a stitch at the top of the leg and we'll take you back through to that day case area and have you wake up in, the, uh, in, that, in that room. Normally it takes about two hours before people are up and about, and uh, usually they stick around for about three or four hours before they go home the same day. People, I normally say, take a couple of days to fully recover. So, uh, you know, advise it to take, easy, take it easy for two, three, four days, and then uh, we will uh, be fully back to normal within about a week. So uh, it's a quick, safe and straightforward procedure. Most people have a really great result these days.